Tomorrow is a big charity day in Minnesota. Reporter Sherelle Moore has a look at how the Bemidji Area Boys and Girls Club is raising funds for Give to the Max Day. Great future start here. Minnesota is celebrating Give to the Max Day. It's also known as a time where our state shows their generous side by giving to the causes that mean the most to them. And here at the club, we've been participating in Give to the Max Day for seven years. It's a pretty fun place and you can basically do whatever you want here. It's pretty fun. The Boys and Girls Club of Bemidji is hoping to raise $20,000 this year. The club serves more than 100 members daily. Our investment in children and uh, teens right here in the Bemidji community will give them opportunities for homework help, tutoring, fitness activities in our gym, gardening during the summertime. I like to hang out in the, in the games room and play foosball with my friends. Football, because I play football and I like doing basketball. Usually if um, the art room calls, I go to the um, gym. I almost always spend my time in the library. I'm a reading maniac. I can't go two hours without reading. Luckily this year, the Boys and Girls Club of Bemidji has a little help from a few special sponsors. We have a $10,000 match from Sue and Steve Engel. Kay and Larry Mack and Valvoline Instant Oil Change. So every dollar that comes in through midnight on November 16th will be matched dollar for dollar. And of course, after Give to the Max Day is over, the club is always looking for volunteers and committee members. We're so thankful for um, the generosity that is pouring out from our community. Reporting of Bemidji, Sherelle Moore, Lakeland News. And many other charities are participating in Give to the Max Day. You can find a complete list at Give mn.org. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.